Now, a, sh a ship loaded with mo uh, motor vehicles in the port of Port Elizabeth was hit by the recent severe weather in the Eastern Cape, as we were just discussing the ports. Now, the damage to cars, trucks and equipment is estimated to be in the millions. ENCA Zingleba Nlanganiso filed this report. This 200-meter-long vessel, which can hold 8,000 cars, has been damaged by severe weather. The chairperson of the Eastern Cape Maritime Business Chamber explains. Uh, the vessel was uh, damaged along uh, its way uh, with the you know, high winds, uh, storms, um, which caused some damages to the, to the vessel itself and the vehicles that it was carrying. The vehicles were moved to the shore. According to Sonti, who estimates the damage might amount to millions of rand, investigations are still underway. The current understanding is that there was obviously a hydraulic failure within the vessel itself whilst it was still at sea, um, and that was a result of the, you know, the, 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 the high seas um, when we had all the storms in the past week. So that is, for now, what we see as the cause towards this incident in that vessel. The chairperson of the Maritime Business Chamber says it's concerning that the incident occurred when they are working to enhance port services. This comes at the time when there has been that previous report which has come out from the World you know, uh, Bank, which highlighted uh, our ports being uh, one of the worst performing. A report that as the industry together with Transnet, we are still you know, uh, refuting uh, based on the methodology that has been used. ENCA contacted the ship owner's agent for comment, but they were unwilling to discuss the matter.